In 2018, the Ministry of Water and Environment initiated the Water and Environment Week organized annually to contribute towards the improvement of Uganda's water and environment resources. While participating in a joint cleanup of the Lira Main Market in a regional commemoration of this year's water and environment celebrations in Lira, Lawrence Igole, the resident city commissioner asked dwellers to keep Lira city habitable. Let us stop contaminating our water sources. Let us stop encroaching on wetlands and swamps. Let us stop cutting trees. Instead, we need to plant trees everywhere. Igole also tasked city leaders to work with the vendors in order to restore hygiene in the facility. We are soon embarking on paving most of the roads within the city this financial year. And if the government is injecting all that in our city here, we have a very small responsibility of keeping this city a city that is admirable. If we cannot keep it clean, even the government and other bodies that will want to assist us will back off because we need to clean, I mean we need to preserve what we have first in order to attract more. So today we are at the Lira Main Market where we are doing the cleaning exercise. Uh, we've been here, the, the whole team from Ministry of Water and Environment and other stakeholders which include SNV, IUCN, MECPA, uh, we have LTP as well, we have Ministry of Health here with us. Under the theme, Water and Environment, Security for Socioeconomic Transformation of Uganda, Brenda Akao, the Communication Officer for Ministry of Water and Environment for Northern Region, said the filthiness of the market poses a serious health threat to the society. Rotten food, they don't have where to throw this. But at least now we are going to make sure the hygiene of the market is okay by cleaning all this rubbish and taking it where it's supposed to be so that they can continue selling the food in a healthy environment. The market that was constructed at a tune of over 28 billion shillings host over 4,000 vendors. The city generates a huge quantity of garbage every day, which Moses Ogwal, the executive director of MECPA, said, if not well managed, will have a serious effect on the ecosystem. We have uh, living organisms that live in this water, water bodies. And it is not good, for example, when pl plastic happens to get the way, maybe someone drop a battery, the dry cells, and gets its way. It affects even the, 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 the human being. So uh, it is dangerous. The activities to commemorate the regional celebrations started on Monday 15th by awareness creation, planting of trees, and cleaning of public facilities, and it is to run through the entire week. Edi for UBC News in Lira City.